guys, Jimmy here. Welcome to another episode of my vlog. Since Christmas is near, I got myself a present. Wait, should be presents. <laughs> so goodbye, 13 month, guys. <laughs> so, uh, as you know, this uh, lately has been quite popular with the figure for the Todd McFarlane. So I decided to buy these two special figures uh, so uh, it took me a while to find for the uh, how you say pre-selling or yeah so so once I checked uh, scoring in the FB page I found out uh, from the big boy big uh, how you say big boys toy store from their web FB page and how you say website so they were pre-selling the figure so I finally got my 30 month and I bought these two figures so today we'll be talking about this. Sorry guys, but I'm only reviewing for this Arkham Knight Batman and what I have for the other one is that Azrael Batman Armor from the Curse of the White Knight series. As you really guys know that it's been quite popular with the Todd McFarlane figure and with the multiverse this one. So I decided uh, to do the first review for this Batman uh, from the PS4 game from the Arkham Knight series mm. so and what's great is that uh, when I ordered these two figure when the package arrived the owner uh, really know how to take good care of the uh, the, should say, the product or the item <coughs> that I put in uh, some picture so you can know how they treat the package very well together with a bubble wrap and and guess what I didn't expect that they would give me a free free beads <laughs> yeah this one I opened this one so you can see it clearly then they give me the how is it Panko Pop the Captain Marvel is quite uh, I really want to expect in this one and they give me this it's really quite nice and I was hoping they would give me Spider-Man so it's okay never mind I don't mind and what do you have here? This another like voucher. Let's say I don't know two sumo dollar for this one. Hope next time I can buy another figure for this one. Okay, so again, uh, I will link the FB page and together with the website and the description. Uh, sorry, the description below so you can check uh, for the Big Boys Toy Store. And thank you so much for the Big Boys for the free bits. Thank you so much, and I hope. To do more review and order from your side <laughs> so again let's talk for this one Arkham Knight it's been one of my favorite figure this one if you can check yeah it's this uh, as I know it's not really easy to find this figure from the mall yeah so especially I know a lot of people are, are doing pre-selling from the online so finally I want to do this one so very happy for the Azrael Batman for I will do it another uh, how you say it another episode for next time okay so stay tuned for this one okay and again this one let's get on let's, let's get it on and do a short review for this one guys okay? let's get started so guys here's the box for the DC multiverse Batman from the Arkham Knight uh, series for the PS4 version and we have the logo here for the McFarlane toys for Todd McFarlane uh, as you have re known know that Todd McFarlane is a Canadian comic creator and best known for the artist uh, Amazing Spider-Man and also one of the writer and artist for the most famous Spawn yes for let's check the box first we have the here is indicate that 22 moving parts this is with uh, 12 year old 12 years old plus <laughs> DC logo multiverse Batman and you have check for the side we have DC logo again multiverse Batman at the back we have a picture of the from the Arkham Knight Batman and we have the let's check, see clearly for the side this one the green no, not the green side for the left side you see this is the Batman from Earth 32 this is the Dawnbreaker which is uh, Batman and Green Lantern they 
collab or hit came the Green Lantern. And we have the other one, it's the Devastator, it's from the Earth One. And the other one is, oh, let's check, it's uh, Azrael Batman from the Curse of the White Knight. I'm not quite familiar for this one. And the other one we have is the Murder Machine from the Earth 44, Batman, which is, uh, he became like a cyborg version. And the last one we have the Grim Knight. Definitely don't have any idea for this one. <laughs> so anyway, let's check this one and unbox. Okay. So guys, we're done with the unboxing. Now it's time to talk about the figure and what accessory we have. So first we have the trading card with Batman uh, picture from the Arkham Knight. And we have the bag with the data file for Batman. <clears throat> this, uh, this, you can see you can do a pause here so you can check out about the data file, what they indicate. So next is the DC base or the stand for you can put a figure here make a standing position for this one make it easier for this one and we have the three talk about the three accessories first if you are familiar with the arkham knight game so you could really know what i'm talking about for this so the first weapon we have here is the remote uh electric charge for this one and the second one is the explosive gel yep a lot of people say it's a grappling gun, but this is the explosive gel from the game. And we have the third weapon is the button ring, remote button with the Batman logo. You see clearly view. Okay. So enough with the accessories and the card and the base. So let's talk about the figure is I'm Batman. <laughs> so we have the, this is the seven inches figure tall. Yep. And let's do a 360 view first. Okay. Sorry, I don't have the how you say it, the stand that can rotate, so I just do it manually. <laughs> Hope once I have the budget, I buy that one. So do a automatic rotate 360. So oops, careful and here. So the first impression for this figure, um, it is quite really great. It really follows from the game from the arkham knight version batman what i kind of don't like is that there's no free extra hand i was hoping that they could have unlike uh other uh as you say japanese figure they always get free uh facial expression and they have extra hand yeah but too bad this one is they don't have but still look really great i really like this figure and the downside part is the, how you say it, the cave. The cave is made of plastic. I was hoping that they would do, uh, make it, uh, how you say it, um, cloth, like the classic figure. But I understand that it's from a far land, so it is always uh, in, how you say it, plastic. So let's check for the articulation, for, guys, and the head, oh, sorry, do it quick. Okay, the head can bend up and down, rotate left and right, left and right, left and right. Yeah, lo, 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 lo. <laughs> So we have the shoulder pad, these two shoulder pads. Be careful with these two shoulder pad. And can the hand, the shoulder can move, rotate 360. Be careful, we have the butterfly joint, how you say it. It's, yeah, and uh, this is the double joint okay double joint elbow again there's always a sound click sound a little i can hear it and we have the hand can rotate 360 okay and the torso too bad the torso cannot bend only the waist part you can hear it okay and up and down up and down <laughs> so next part is the mm, Let's say the legs the legs can bend up and down can rotate yeah a little but i don't want to do rotate too much if i get broken so we have another this is the double joint knee same as the one uh, with the, his hand, uh, elbow the double joint elbow 
So the, let's check the ankle. Ankle can move. And then the toe hinge. And uh, that's really great. Okay, the back. Okay, let's check again to choose review. The face. Yeah. Very nice. I really like this one. I'm uh, really excited to do the next review for the as well Batman armor. And I I I bought yeah I ordered from the other sh another shop for the spawn uh, from the Mortal Kombat uh, version from the McFarlane also I want to do a picture and do a, put these two figures together since you have noticed that there's a comic uh, Spawn team up with Batman so both are my huge uh, how you say it superhero Spawn is more, more on like an anti-hero but I don't mind it really look good so enough with those things let's get back to the figure I'll show you some picture of this uh, Batman figure uh, holding with the weapons together okay let's check it out guys So guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys all enjoyed this review. And hopefully next time we can see you again and do another toy review. And advance Merry Christmas. By the way, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. Always feel free to leave a comment below. And also don't forget to hit the notification. So once I upload a new video, you will get notified. And check out my new video. Okay, so that's it for today. Thank you so much guys. See you next time and please take care and stay safe. Jimmy's out. Bye-bye.